Hi guys and dolls. Well, today is the day. It's Saturday and the Chelsea Christmas lights are being switched on. I am going to take you all around Chelsea with me today and show you decorations, fireworks, maybe some reindeer <laughs> and you can all enjoy it with me. I hope you have a great time watching this video. Get yourself something very Christmassy to eat and something very Christmassy to drink and kick back and enjoy. So we'll kick this special Christmas in Chelsea vlog off by a walk through our gorgeous decorated tunnel here on the way to Duke of York Square. Isn't this very, very pretty? I love all this ribbon with the writing on. I'm gonna give it a bit of a zoom when I get back in to see what it says, because I can't see. I'll give you a little bit of a view from the top. Look at this. Lovely holly. So pretty. I love how they do this tunnel up every year in the seasons. It's so effective and such a nice feature. Look at that. Beautiful. I'll get a picture while it's clear. <laughs> Found some information for you guys. There you go. You can have a little read of that if you're interested. Okay, so I think we found day seven of the 12 days of Christmas already. Look at the seven swans are swimming. Look at their golden eggs. This is so cute. I just read the um, signage and this is all like bespoke, the scroll with the um, lyrics on. This is beautiful. Oh, I wonder what else we're gonna find. This is incredible, I love it take you a bit closer so you can have a look. Look at the feathers. There is seven. The smaller ones, see? Four calling birds. <laughs> look at those up there. Gorgeous. And I spy something in front too. Look at this. I've never seen them do anything here before. I'm guessing it's going to light up. But look how beautiful this is. It goes all the way to the top. It reminds me of the um, Blackpool Tower Ballroom. <laughs> Maybe I'm just got strictly on the brain because it's Blackpool tonight. Look, how cute is this? This is so sweet, beautiful flowers. So we'll walk around a little bit. It's all gone very Chelsea in bloom. Look at the holly and the poinsettias. This is so pretty. Yeah, it must light up. We'll come back later. We've got trees around it and everything. Oh, I'm excited to see this later on when the lights get switched on. I like all this writing around it on the ribbon. Look. Wow. This is so pretty. They're by our gorgeous little statues. I love these. So this is just in the side bit here, going into Duke of York Square, and there's a great big reef down there. So we'll pop that later and see it illuminated. Guys, I found number nine. What's that? Nine ladies dancing? Am I wrong? <laughs> Look at this, by the Saatchi Gallery, and there's some here as well. Oh, that's the stage, can you see it? That's where it all happens yeah. later. Look at this one. Entrance to Saatchi Gallery, open 10 till 6 today. <laughs> Look at that. Look at the bells. So pretty. There you go, it's going to look so pretty when it's all illuminated later. So here we are in the square, and thank you to the band and <laughs> for striking up just in time for me to film them. Let's go and have a little listen for a while.
the band at Christmas time. Oh, I hope they stay for a little while. So I've actually come early because I'm just going over to Partridges in the corner there because uh, I think it was during the summer, um, the original, one of the original Rolling Stones, Bill Wyman, the bassist, he published a book about Chelsea. So obviously I was all over that because I love the Stones and I love Chelsea. And I thought it was pretty incredible that a part of Chelsea history had written about Chelsea history. And unfortunately, I missed his signings that he did at the World's End Bookshop and Partridges before. So I'm really happy that he's back. So I'm going to dash in there with a copy of my book. Hope I get to see him. And actually, I'd quite like a photo. <laughs> so if I get a photo, I'll insert one here. So here's my gorgeous book, which is now signed. So happy about that. That was really, really fun. So well done, Partridges. I'm glad I got to see Mr. Wyman. exciting because this little area here this grass area is hardly ever open and it's open till half past three today and we've all these little stalls selling food and I'm going to take you <laughs> I'm not going to show you just yet I'm going to take you over there I'm going to get muddy suede boots but I'm prepared to get muddy suede boots for these guys <laughs> oh I hope I can see them nicely look Oh my goodness, look, let's go this way, let me get into a position for us guys, look at him, oh my goodness, hello, what one do you reckon that one is, I think that's Blitzen, oh my gosh look what he's doing, here you go, I zoom you in. He's <laughs> having a good old munch, isn't he? Look at them antlers. So gorgeous. This one's very, very chill. Look. <laughs> He's like Alfie of a morning when I try and walk him, just, you know, not really happening. He's happy enough. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hi! Hi! <laughs> Hello, chap! Thank you! <laughs> He's a poser. You're posing! Oh, I'm so glad I got to see these. I never saw them last year because I missed them. <gasps> How lovely for the children to see the reindeer. Bless. I'm going to give somebody else a go at the front now. <laughs> Look what he's doing now. Oh. Look at him go. <laughs> what do we have here? Look at these. Hi. <laughs> so on special occasions like uh, the coronation and jubilees, we always have the King's Road close to traffic and we get like little stalls here. And then obviously everybody can stand and watch the lights being switched on. There's more space and there's fireworks that get set off on the green. But it says it's going to be a little bit different this year. So I'm excited to see what's going to happen. So here's a shot of everything going on at the moment. There's a beautiful smell of mulled wine. So I'm going to get one. Can you see how gorgeous? I know where that store is now. Oh, it will be frequenting that a lot today. I absolutely love mulled wine. 
so let's just give you a little look of they're all down there as well at the weekends Chelsea normally has like a little food market on Duke of York Square but obviously today it's extra big and extra special and you have a big screen up there so everybody can see what's happening on the stage you have like singers and Santa he used to come in a um, carriage and go along here because it's the Santa that goes into Peter Jones's with his elves for the season so it's a nice little entry for him I'll keep my eyes out and if I see him I don't think he did it last year but if I see him, I will show you because he's always a beautiful, beautiful Santa. Obviously, some of these places like Page there, these are like little outside stalls of restaurants that we have. Here, there you go. There's the botanist that's up at Sloan Square. And there's the big screen. Look at these guys like Lord Chamberlain's <laughs> are they in panto oh I'm sorry look at them I'm gonna stalk them <laughs> we've got some singers here by the gorgeous this is iconic this is the light up Kings Road sign there was a band here earlier when I was trotting up so I'll insert those clips for you but have a little listen to these gorgeous singers
and just to make it a very authentic Saturday in Chelsea, here is the King's Road Registry Office for Wedding. <laughs> Complete with wedding taxi. I love this.
the queue over there it's mad so many people but thankfully we're sitting here and we have a couple of nice glasses of wine so we're gonna enjoy those now Merry Christmas obviously after our nice wine we've had to come down to look at the baubles and since we're here last guys look what's arrived the Venus flytrap teddy <laughs> from the advert and you can have a Venus flytrap snapper book and a ball ball so there's like a little whole range that you can get and if you look on the tree there's a cuddly one that's him and also look at this gorgeous card I found it's a shop and there's me lion <laughs> love it it's in the window too is just by Peter Jones's Cadogan Gardens this is and look at this um, members club here I love those lights actually twinkling oh, magical
So there we have it guys and dolls, thank you so so much for watching this vlog from my day at the Kings Road Chelsea Christmas light switch on. It was the busiest I have ever ever seen it. I think people had come in from all over um, London because the mayor doesn't do a big big switch on for Oxford Street or Regent Street now so I think loads of people want to come and watch a proper good show and I hope they enjoyed it as much as I did. Let me know what you all thought in the comments. I'll leave you now with some shots of Chelsea dressed for the season, but get ready for loads more of those throughout my Vlogmas, which I look forward to bringing you all very, very soon. Take good care of yourselves. Have a really good week. Loads and loads of love from London, Queenie.